It is election day and we are just over an hour away from the polls closing. With a record year for early voting, there was still a steady flow of voters getting in their ballots today. News 13's Rebecca Atkins is live at the voting location at 98th and Central with what voters there are saying. Rebecca? Well, Dean and Jess, the county clerk's office tells us this has been one of the busiest locations today, far surpassing 8,000 voters. That's far from the numbers we've seen in years past when early voting wasn't as popular. But with little to no wait times at most of the locations in the county, voters are in a pretty good mood. It's our constitutional right. <laughs> that was, that's what makes us an American is our right to vote. It's important to come out and vote if you want to make a change. If not, there's no change is ever going to happen without the voice of the people. This is a look at the polling location at Bandelier Elementary School. Earlier today, you can see a steady line of voters in Bernalillo County. Today, there have been more than 54,000 voters compared to the 149,000 early voters. As for why people waited until today to get in their votes, most people say they either forgot or didn't make the time. Others just like voting on Election Day. I've always liked to come out and be with my fellow citizens and see a complete cross-section of those fellow citizens. It's great. It's fun. We thought we'd come at lunch and beat the rush, but it seems like we're actually doing what everyone else was doing. As for the numbers statewide, more than 132,000 voters hit the polls today, adding early and absentee ballots. 571,000 people have cast their votes statewide. Now, breaking down the numbers, Democrats have surpassed Republicans in voting, but there are more registered Democrats than Republicans in the state. Dean and Jess, back to you.